everyone, it's Lisa Sablehouse with the Sablehouse team of Remax Town Center. And today's edition of Local Love, we are going to be promoting the Clarksburg 5K. I am here talking with Mark Young, and he has been running this program now for 14 years, running, no pun intended. <laughs> and it always benefits the community, not only just to get us in healthy and running mode, but to benefit the different charity uh, organizations that are the beneficiaries of the funds that we raise. So can you tell us a little bit about the background of the program and kind of from its start to its uh, current state? Sure, so back in 2008, we, a uh, group, a small group of us were wanted to, this is kind of early in the Clarksburg development era, none of the shopping center was here. Right. Um, we were looking to do an event that would bring the community together. And uh, we were able to, um, partner with uh, um, Montgomery County Roadrunners who, who uh, gave us a lot of uh, guidance sure. on that and we put on that first event, uh, a couple of hundred runners that first year and we've been going ever since. Well, I know it's not just the 5K, because I know you have a lot of kids that participate too. Can you tell us about that event? It's the highlight of my morning. Yeah. <laughs> um, my morning starts that day at probably 4 a.m. and I make it a point to stop what I'm doing and be there for the kids' fun run because it's it's it just puts a smile on your face. Well, it does, and I can specifically remember when right about I was about half a mile from the finish line, and I think a 11-year-old actually was sprinting <laughs> by me to finish. So yeah. they bypassed the kids run and just decided to take yeah. out the adults. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and that's the beauty of this is it's a walk. It's a, the 5K is a walk. It's a run. You, we have a lot of families that sign up and do it together, which is which is awesome. Uh, groups, teams, uh, we, we encourage you know, come one, come all. Because right. it's, a, it's a community oriented event, it's not competitive. Well, I know it's a great opportunity too for um, for businesses like ourselves to become not only participants but sponsorship. Can you go over the different sponsor levels for people? Sure, so so we have a variety of levels mm -hmm. for uh, businesses to join uh, and partner with us uh, as sponsors. Right. Um, because we, again, we want to cast a wide, as wide a net as possible to, for, for people to be able to, to participate. Um, so we have we we have a, 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 our copper level, which is the lowest level um, where businesses can can sign up for. We have the, the silver level, the gold level, and then um, uh, that's generally where the businesses will come in at. And um, we have had as many as 15 to 18 businesses sponsor uh, in some years. Because what we really want to do is kind of bring the people to the businesses and the businesses to the people because what we want to do there is help businesses um, build their client base right. and, and form those relationships. And uh, we've had sponsors for many years, yourself included, which we're very thankful for um, and because we don't take that for granted. Right. Right. And uh, do you change the beneficiaries each year or is it always the same? We look at that each year, and we decide on a year-to-year -year basis. Um, the last few years, we've we've kept the same beneficiaries. Mm -hmm. um, we um, want to support local yes. um, uh, groups that are that are trying to support the local community. So we sponsor Clarksburg Can, which is the Community Action Network, which is a food pantry right. that helps um, uh, people. Um, you know, you hear the expression sometimes they. Um, run out of money before they run out of month mm. and so people need some help just kind of getting getting to the end of the month there so we help we we help support Clarksburg can uh, we some support um, the dwelling place which helps people transition out of homelessness by um, teaching them vocational skills to help them work their way out of homelessness okay. um, we support um, Clarksburg Closet, yes. which this past weekend just did a prom dress giveaway, and I heard yesterday that they gave away over, I think it was over 100 prom dresses. That's so great. And then we also support Compassion International, which um, um, is an international organization that um, serves underprivileged uh, people, underprivileged youth throughout the world. Okay. Well, it's a really fun event. You always have great music blasting in the morning, get people revved up, and then of course when you're crossing the finish line and finishing there's always some food and refreshments and of course seeing all the all of the community members and all getting together so we have been very fortunate to participate in it over the last several years so happy that it's back and going after you know the year reprieve 
If you haven't signed up for this event as a runner or a sponsor, make sure you visit Clarksburg5k.com. All the information is there. You can preview the route. You can see what sponsors are there. You can um, visit those sponsors, but uh, definitely come on out and support your neighbors. Even if you're not running, it's a lot of fun. It's a party in the morning. And again, the most important thing is the date. <laughs> so I believe this year it is Saturday, April 30th. April 30th. Excellent. Nice and early. So make sure you visit the website for all the information. Thank you so much, Mark. Thank you Thank for everything. You. And for Lisa, too. You got to let her know that we said hello. Absolutely. <laughs> Thanks.